हेलो एवरीवन दिस इज आरोही एंड वेलकम बैक टू माय चैनल कोड विद आरोही इन माय टुडेज वीडियो आई विल टॉक अबाउट न्यूरल स्टाइल ट्रांसफर सो बेसिकली दिस न्यूरल स्टाइल ट्रांसफर इज आल्सो नोन एज एन नेटवर्क एंड व्हाट इज एन नेटवर्क सी एन नेटवर्क्स आर कॉन्वोल्यूशनल न्यूरल नेटवर्क ओनली एंड वी आर यूजिंग दीज न्यूरल स्टाइल ट्रांसफर नेटवर्क फॉर ट्रेनिंग our computers like how to do this artwork right so basically deep learning for art basically this is uh, under this neural style transfer we have convolutional neural networks using them you can you know train your algorithms to perform art let me show you one example of this ai artwork so this is the ai artwork and this artwork was sold for this amount right so you can see like the way human do artwork and you know uh, those uh, the artists the painters they uh, get a very good amount um, for their work in the same way we can perform the same artwork using ai we can train our algorithms to perform artwork and this is one of the example of that particular artwork so in my today's video i'll show you how we can train our algorithm to perform to you know do this artwork all right so let's start with this example suppose this is a image right this is a image and on this image we want to perform this kind of art means what we want is we want this image in this kind of you know uh, style so with the help of deep learning with the help of this neural style network right neural style uh, transfer nst network we can do that see when you want to perform this kind of when you want to apply this kind of style on this image this is the output which you are getting after performing you know after training your network right you can see this image over here these are the persons which are here in the image and this is the style of the image so on this image we have performed this style and this is what we are getting as a output of neural style transfer network right so let's see let's understand it in more detail let's see the logic how it is working so how this a uh, network actually works how this work starts okay so as i just told you this nst network is a convolutional neural network only but the thing over here is we are not training our network right so if we are not training our network that means we are not going to update the weights and we are not going to update the bias we are not using convolutional neural network for training our network right so in nst network the this training part is not there we are not training our convolutional neural network that means we are not going to update the weights and we are not going to update the biases also right then how we are using this convolutional neural network let's see that functionality see the very initial step of this um, nst network is so we have two kind of images this is content image this is a main image right this is a content image right and this is our style image right so in nst we have two images two kind of images one is style image and other one is content image content image the image on which we want to perform some kind of you know uh, different styling and style image is the image uh, basically this is the image this is how we want our this image looks like okay so we have two kind of images and what we want is we want to basically copy the style of this image in this image right we want to copy the style or we want to transfer the style of this image to this image right so for that initially we are starting with the blank image okay this will finally become our output image this will be the generated result right styled image this is our styled image over here right so at initial step over here we are having a blank image like this with some random pixels on it okay now as i just told you we are not updating the weights and we are not updating the bias what we are updating over here is we are updating the image 
after every epoch right so the at initial epoch we have some random pixels over here and this is our image okay and after one epoch we want to update the image and how we are updating the image means we are updating the uh, pixel values okay by updating the image i simply want to uh, i simply mean to say we are updating the pixel values we are modifying the pixel values after every every epoch and how we get to know like what all pixels value we have to modify for that see uh, the main idea of this nst network is to uh, the main goal is to find basically uh, how this nst work it works means we will calculate the loss function we will calculate the loss function for content image in the same way we will calculate the loss function for this style image and we will calculate the loss function for this generated image and then we will compare the loss function of all these three images and our task is to minimize the loss right why we want to minimize the loss what we want is that the similarity between these images should be more and if the similarity is more then only we can you know uh, reduce the loss function right how we can get more similarity between these pictures if the loss is less so the ultimate goal is to reduce the loss our task is to reduce the loss so that we can have much similarity between these pictures this is what we want right and our ultimate goal is to reduce the loss function right and how we are doing that see for example in first epoch we have calculated the loss function for this and we have calculated the loss function for this and in the same way we have calculated the loss function for this on the basis of that we are updating the random pixel of this let me show you with more proper uh, you know way so see guys this example i have just created just to make you understand okay so uh, assume this is a uh, content image this is a content image this content image is going through a convolutional neural network and after convolutional neural network we are calculating the loss and that loss function is content loss function okay in the same way this is a style image style image is also going through a convolutional neural network and after that we are calculating a style loss okay now this style loss and this content loss we are doing the total over here and on the basis of that we are having one output image right this so let's understand this whole functionality with the help of practical example that way you will understand the concepts in a more deeper way right so so this is the code and guys uh, before moving to the code i would like to tell you few things the uh, code the model which i'm going to use in my today class is a pre trained model i'm just uh, you know uh, uh, i'll load that model and i'll show you how to uh, implement it right in my next class i'll show you how to create your a custom model which can perform this nst tasks right with the help of which you can perform your own art you will write your own algorithm i'll show you that in my next class but in my today's class i'll show you how to use pre trained algorithm for that particular task so for that see uh, i am using tensorflow hub basically what this tensorflow hub is this is basically a repository where lots of pre trained machine learning and deep learning algorithms are present in it right you can directly call them call them call those algorithm and you can use them right so uh, the algorithm which i'm going to use today the pre trained algorithm that is by magenta magenta is basically a open source project by google google help uh, you know uh, artists and musicians uh, for their ml task through this uh, platform right magenta uh, network and in my today's class i'm using this magenta's arbitrary image stylization network this is what we are going to use today using this i'll show you how to do uh, stylization how to perform art on any image all right 
so whenever we work on any algorithm first of all we, we we import all the required modules so this is what i'm doing over here i'm importing all the required modules and these few lines are just telling the versions which i'm using so i'm using this tensorflow version okay and after that here so first of all from tensorflow hub i'm i'm importing this tensorflow hub okay and see as i've just told you in my uh, theory just few minutes back that we are going to have two image one will be our content image and other one will be our styling image right style image so content path so this is the path of my content image so my content image is in the same folder so that's why i've written the name of that image only right and style path is having the image which have our uh, the data related to styling this is a styling image right so this is a content image and this is a styling image now the next thing is first of all before performing the task on it right i just want to uh, show you what all images i'm working upon what what are the what are those two images so what i'm doing is i'm reading those images two images right and and then plotting them so these are the two images so this is my content image and this is my styled image all right now we will use the pre trained network to uh, do art on it so for that what i'm doing is so it's very simple first of all we are reading the images and then we are converting the images into array because computer will understand the image in the form of array only so that's what we are doing over here after that this part is optional actually so what we are doing is we are resizing our style image right so this part is optional you can even comment it so why i'm just resizing it because it is recommended right to uh, resize your uh, style image into 256 into 256 so that's why i'm doing otherwise you can skip this step all right so we have read the image we have converted the image into array now we are going to implement the algorithm on it so the algorithm is this hub dot load load is a method using which we are loading um, the algorithm which is present in our tensorflow hub repository and this is the path of that algorithm okay now after that what we are doing is we are giving in hub module variable i have loaded the uh, model right and after that i'm passing uh the two images to it so we are going to pass two images right content image and the style image so this is what we are doing this is the variable which is storing content image and this is the variable which is storing our style image and this is style stylized image output zero zero simply means because we are working on single image only the output will be single uh, uh value only so that's why uh, we have written zero over here after that this is a simple function using this function right we are finally getting the output you can see this is our input image content image this is our styled image and this is the output this is the art created by our deep learning algorithm you can see like this style got copied on this and this is what we are getting over here so guys this is what nst is so this that's it guys if you like my video please subscribe my channel and thank you for watching